Pima County Chairwoman Adelita Grijalva in some hot water tonight after a photo she shared on her personal on her personal Facebook page, sparking some outrage. News for Tucson's Jafet Serrato is live downtown. Jafet, we know there was a Board of Supervisors meeting today, and we understand several people voiced their concerns over the post, and the supervisor responded. That's right, Monica. We're going to show you the sign in question in just a few seconds. But first, the sign was posted just outside of downtown here behind me near Broadway Boulevard. It's unknown who made the sign, but it is not here anymore. What we do know is that the chairwoman social media post made a lot of people very upset, saying that someone in her position should not be posting content like that, while others say they see nothing wrong with it. This is the sign in question. The first word is blurred out because it says an expletive right above the MAGA slogan. The bottom says no more orange in Spanish, presumably making fun of former President Donald Trump's skin color. Adelita, your actions are a direct threat to our constitutional republic. More than a handful of people showed up to Tuesday's Pima County Board of Supervisors meeting to express their outrage over this picture Chairwoman Adelita Grijalva shared on her personal Facebook last week. I now see that your hypocrisy has no bounds, Adelita. Although the post has since been deleted, Grijalva captioned the post with, quote, Welcome to Tucson. I commented on this public post and asked if it was appropriate. In previous um, board meetings, you have promoted ending hate speech. And that was a common theme for people who spoke out against the post Tuesday, questioning Grijalva's character. You are the one that incites the violence. Grijalva was not shy to respond. I'll acknowledge wrongdoing when Trump apologizes for the racist, misogynistic, sexist, inflammatory comments he's made. Some of the people deciding to walk out while she was addressing the crowd, but not everyone was upset about her actions. Um, I don't find it to be inappropriate or harmful. It's kind of disgraceful. Realistically, we need to be focusing on root issues. Corvin Walker lives in Grijalva's district. He says all this fighting is taking attention away from other important topics on the county agenda. There's no reason why in our current economic state that I should be paying $1,800 a month for a house that I got homeless people right next to me. Roads where I've blown out my tire. There's no indication that Grijalva will be reprimanded or censored for sharing this post. It's something that some people have called for. Live downtown, Chvetserado, News 4 Tucson.